One left when he made that unscheduled pit stop. A car into the wall, several into the wall, as a matter of fact. L.D. Ottinger is involved, Brandon Baker, Kenny Wallace, Bobby Hillen, just a multi-car tangle up in turn number two. Patty Moise is involved in it. I believe Jack Ingram. Yeah, one of the contenders for the point championship. Here There's Eldie Ottinger. He's also a contender for the championship. He pulls out and pulls away. He's driving away. Here comes Jack Ingram also pulling away. The 98 car there is Ron LaBelle from Essex Junction, Vermont, one of the Bush Grand National North drivers. Well, this is certainly the most serious crash of the day, and there is the damage on Jack Ingram's number 11. Cole has been his sponsor for a number of years. He'll come in and try to get some work done on that, even though Jack hasn't won since March of 1987. Let's see what happened. It looked like the car number 33, Jim Sauter, and the car number two of L.D. Ottinger got together as they went into the turn. There's Mark Martin down on the inside, and look at him go through as the car... Bobby Hillen, yeah, I think that's Hillen yeah. spinning around. Bobby Hillen got knocked around real well. Here it is again from another angle. That's Jim Sauter in yeah. the beige 33. Now, L.D. spins down, down the racetrack. Doesn't look like he's hit too much, but I tell you what, Brandon Baker comes in and plows into Bobby Hillen good. And then Bobby Hillen gets hit also by number 98, Ron LaMelle. Now, let's go to Jack Aroot with a report on the pit stop by the...